Hello everyone, welcome back to another video. This is episode 15 of the 16 episode series where I'm going to be taking you from nothing to profitable. If you're enjoying this series, make sure to let me know down in the comments below. And if there's anything that you weren't clar clarifying throughout the whole process, put it in the comments down below as well because the next episode I'll be doing a little bit of a Q&A and answering some of those questions that you've had throughout the series. This episode, episode 15, is about self-analysis throughout this whole process and finding out whether you are ready to be trading live. So look back all the way to week one and say, have I improved? Um, depending on where you are in your trading journey, this is gonna be different for you know different people. If you've never traded before, it's gonna be a big difference. If you've been trading for five years, it's probably not gonna be that much of a difference, but um, look back and say, have I actually improved? Look at your trading and say to yourself, am I actually ready to be trading live? Do I have that confidence in myself? to be putting my money on the line or other people's money and trading that capital. Now, in terms of trading your own money versus trading other people's money, you need to also decide where you're gonna get this capital from. Are you gonna do it with your own funds? Are you gonna to go to a prop firm? Um, are you actually gonna try and get a, a, a job in, an, in a real firm in, ter in terms of, for me, trading from, from an online prop firm is not the same as getting a job and being a prop firm trader. They are very, very, very different things. One, I would see as non-professional and the other as professional. Obviously more options than that, but which where, which, where are you gonna get capital from? That is the question that you need to be answering. Where are you going to get your capital from? So this is all about just preparing yourself for trading live or working on yourself a little bit more. For example, do you have all of the routines in place for your trading? Have you built habits throughout these 16 episodes or 15 episodes that supplement your trading and make it better? How did your challenge um, accounts go? How did your demo challenges go? Um, you should have been trading for a full month on demo. Um, so how did that go? Do you feel like you're ready to be trading? Did you find that your psychology was good or did, do you need to improve it? You know, it's not just about whether your you know trading results are good, but it's also about whether your psychology is good with that as well and whether they actually combine into something that is tradable for the long term so answer these few questions um there's a lot more that you can go into you know basically this is all about self-reflection the more you can self-reflect on these past 15 episodes and the progress that you've made and your confidence levels throughout that then if you've actually seen results and you feel like you can trade profitably then you know you're ready to get going and i'm not going to be saying yes you know go and trade live um because i'm not a financial advisor but if you feel like you're ready after these 15 episodes then you know go ahead and 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 see how it goes now it's going to be different you know you can try and ease yourself into it you could just put a small amount of money in and trade it and then maybe put a larger amount then go for someone else's money. There's lots of different ways you can do this. You go straight into a prop firm, you go to private investors. This is up to you. This is how confident you are in your trading and yourself to follow that trading plan that you created. But it's up to you, right? Self-reflect on yourself and how you've improved and see, am I ready to trade live? Um, if you are, let me know down in the comments below and let me know how you've developed throughout this, this series. Um, I really do want to hear from you. And if you have any questions for tomorrow's episode, let me know as well, because I will be doing a little bit of a QA. and a If there's not that many questions, then I'll just answer some general questions. But, you know, I'm sure there will be a few questions throughout the whole, uh, whole of the episodes. But I hope you've enjoyed it. I hope you've enjoyed this series and seen improvement throughout it. Um, I, I wish you the best of luck with your trading. And, um, yeah. Hope you've enjoyed it. If you did, hit the like button and remember traders, trade happy.